centre of the course, coming on electric finish. Do it again. He's coming at Rainbow Bridge. He's a board leader and he will do it again. It's time to take a look at Andrew and my exotic bet selections and how we've played it, as we said during the show. Yes, Andrew and I for poles apart for most of the races, but that's fine. Let's at least hope one of us will be right. Place accumulator time. That's my perm on screen at 216 Rand is what will get you for 100%. Share in that perm. 610 first leg by 1, 4 and 5, by 3, 9 and 10, then 6 and 8, 5th leg 2 and 6, 6th leg 1, 2, 8, and the last leg, Banker, leading fast for Sean Terry and Lyle Hewitson. Andrew, your uh, perm is a little bit cheaper than mine. It's a lot cheaper than yours. <laughs> <laughs> Take us through your numbers. Yeah, I, I, I thought, well, it's, it's a difficult card, so I'll just give the, the bones of, of, of the PA. So first leg, I've gone uh, 10 and 2. I think 10 possibly you could bank. Uh, I've banked number 5, Hot Money, by 8 and 3. Taken a big chance with number two, uh, Uncle Charlie. And then I've gone two and six. They're by four and six and by two leading fast. Okay, that's uh, Andrew's PA. Yes, you've banked. Uh, well, you've taken a chance with uh, Uncle Charlie and that's fine. You know, it's nice to try and find a bit of value because if those value bets come in, uh, that's where the kicker comes yeah. and that's where the money comes. So, uh, and on today's card certainly uh, could spring one or two results. Let's look at the pick six. Oh, it's not easy. I've got a 700 Rand perm. And uh, first leg, 1, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Second leg, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, and 10. Then in the sixth race, I've just got the two horses. Horses 6, red 8, and 8, Tarzan. Then the next leg again, only two horses, Wonderwall, and approach control, the penultimate leg, one, two, five, seven, and eight. And as you'll see, I've gone all in, number two, leading fast, banker in my place accumulator, banker in my pick six, and I do believe he is, she is, the better bet on the card. Andrew, your pick six? Yeah, also mine's a little bit uh, shorter than yours. I've gone uh, first leg five, six, seven. Sorry, uh, let me interrupt you. Obviously, your bank manager didn't allow you as much credit as mine did. My bank manager, if he, <laughs> if he saw I was punting, he'd probably shoot me. Right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go through your Okay, point. first leg, five, six, and seven. Uh, second leg, eight, three, five, and four. Uh, then I've gone all out, all in for number two. Um, Uncle uh, Charlie. Uncle yep. Charlie, yeah. By two, six, four. By four, six, two, and 12. And then just in case leading my fast goes missing, I've put in eight and 11 as well in the last leg. Okay, well structured. Nice to see different perms and different ways of structuring our bets. And uh, yeah, that's uh, what it's all about. Jackpot time. Uh, I've gone uh, as always. Well, not as always. Most of the time I go the middle four legs of my pick six. And this time I have three, four, five, six, seven, nine, and ten. By just the two horses, six and eight. By the next leg, again, only the two horses, two and six. And the last leg, one, two, five, seven, and eight. For 140 rand, Andrew will give you his perm and then come back to me. Uh, right, my perm, I've gone first leg eight, three, five, and four by Uncle Charlie. If that loses, there'll be a lynch mob outside the studio. Uh, by two, six, and four, by four, six, two, and 12 for 60 rands. 60 rand will get you a full unit for Andrew's jackpot. No, there won't be a lynch mob outside the studio. Use it as a guide, use it as you feel. Andrew's in the camp of the play of the day, Uncle Charlie, my play of the day is leading fast.